I would say that Walk Aid has given us a sense of security and freedom to do what families do, to be more of a family and to do more things together. Oh, I always worry that she's gonna fall. Just because of the brain damage she already has, I don't want any more. You know, the doctors told us she wouldn't walk and she's doing ballet. I mean, that's, that's a pretty big miracle. Walk Aid gives her back a more normal life. She's like any other kid. My walking helps me not fall like this. My name is Michelle Richardson, and this is my daughter Zoe Richardson. She was born at 29 weeks. Um, they told us that she suffered a grade four intraventricular hemorrhage that caused brain damage to um, the right side of her body, therefore affecting the left side of the body. They told us not to expect anything. They told us don't expect her to walk and that her prognosis just wasn't very good. With her cerebral palsy, she, um, she tends to fall a lot. She trips on her feet sometimes when she's trying to run with her sisters, trying to keep up with them. Um, family activities like going for walks and things like that can be really tiresome for her, so our walks tend to be shorter and just not, not keep up. That kind of breaks a mom's heart. <laughs> she generally walks well, but when she walks, she drags her foot. Um, she doesn't get the full, her timing is kind of off, like sometimes it pulls up and she'll fall forward, um, especially when she runs. You know, first we had the AFO, and that was a good solution to the problem at the time. Her AFO is a, molded piece of plastic that's she's casted and then molded to fit her exact foot size at the time and we usually got a new one every eight months to a year and it would be hinged sometimes I'd have to buy two different um, pairs of shoes one to fit that foot and one to fit the other foot a size up and a size down and it was sweaty on her because it was big plastic it would go up to the back of her calf not comfortable for her to walk long distances in at all but now with the walk aid, it has definitely given us what what she's been lacking and what she's needed. Because it helps me not fall down. Walk aid is a device that sends electricity to the nerves and it triggers the nerves to um, bring her foot up at the right moment according to how she's walking and according to her own special gait and it helps her to walk more smoothly and more steadily. What does it help you do? It helps my foot to come up. She, you know, she puts it on every day, and usually we put it on and forget about it. We turn it off when she takes a nap, turn it back on when she wakes up for her nap, and it's no big deal, and it's just easy. I like pushing the button. You like pushing the button? Mm-hmm. The touch button. I showed her the walk aid video on the website, and her first response before saying anything else was, I get to wear any shoes I want. She was so excited that she didn't have to only wear one specific pair of shoes, the only pair of shoes I could find. She could pick her shoes this time. I didn't have to pick them for her, and she can have any kind of shoe she wants and that's what she was happy about. I said, dear Lord, thank you for me not having have to... Um, not have to wear what? My AFO in me. Your AFO? Yeah. How come? Because I like the new one. You like the new what? Walk aid. The walk aid. I cried um, when she ran. When she walks, you know, I see a little bit of a difference, but when she runs is when I really see the difference. I've never seen her run so stable and so easily. When she doesn't have her walk aid on, you can see how much effort it is and how wobbly she is, um, but the walk aid is just more straight and stable and a lot easier for her to use. It definitely gives her more of a normalcy to life. She can keep up with her sisters a lot better. She can run around the yard with them a lot better. She can race them um, much easier than she could before. Normally she would run halfway and just give up. We're just able to do a lot more activities 
our walks are longer. Um, I don't live in fear that she's just going to be running around playing with other kids and she's just going to fall. I have a sense of security. My husband can't be here. He's deployed and it gives him peace of mind. And I'm getting some peace to die. She did Iraq. It improves our whole family's lives. It affects us all. I would say try it because it's so worth it. It improves their lives tremendously. It provides peace of mind for me. It's, it's really priceless. I would tell them that it's definitely worth the investment. If you don't have the money, raise the money. There's always ways to get it and it's worth it. When the doctors had told us in the NICU that Zoe had CP, that she has all this brain damage, we had already decorated their nursery in baby ballerinas. And to go back to that nursery day after day and see these ballerinas that you know we probably wouldn't ever have because we were told they wouldn't be capable. I'm gonna do ballet. Now, she can be a ballerina. It's what she likes doing. And we're just thankful that she's able to do that and 